Hey guys, uh, this is uh, Abhijit Barai. So for the next few minutes, uh, I'm going to show you how to increase the resolution of the images or figures that you would like to send to the medical journal for publication. One of the reasons uh, many uh, manuscripts are rejected by the editors or the editorial board is because of the low quality of the resolution of the images or figures. Most of the journals uh, want a resolution of at least 300 dot per inch or DPI, both horizontally and vertically. Uh, many of the journals want the resolution to be 720 DPI. So let me show you how to check it uh, and how to improve it to make it acceptable to the medical journals. So if you right click on uh, the image and uh, go to the properties, then you will see that there are a lot of uh, informations about that particular image is there. If you go to the details, then it will show how much resolution is. As you can see in this uh, figure three, horizontal resolution is 96 dot per inch or DPI, and the vertical resolution is 96 DPI as well. So if you print out this particular image, then the resolution will be quite poor and that's why the journals don't accept this type of uh, images. As I've said, the minimum resolution that uh, the journals would like to have is 300 DPI. So I'm going to show you how to increase it to 300, but if some of the journal wants 720, that's fine, you can do that, it's very simple. So, the software that uh, you will need is um, something called GIMP. It's a free software. You can uh, download it uh, easily. So, I've got the GIMP2. And um, the good thing with this particular software is that um, it is very quick. It, it is not so slow like uh, Photoshop. And as I've said, it is freely available. Most of the function, uh, functions are similar to that of Photoshop. So let's uh, open uh, this uh, file. Um, as I've shown you that figure three uh, we are working on. So let's uh, open that file called figure three. Uh, another thing is that most journals, they don't accept uh, uh, JPEG or JPEG. They would like to have TIF format. So this particular figure is in TIF, but as I, as I have just shown you that the resolution is quite poor, 96 dpi. Now to improve the resolution, what you need to do is go to image, and then there is an option called print size. If you press on print size, then it will show what the current resolution is. So X resolution is 96 DPI and Y resolution is 96 DPI. It's also called pixel per inch. So I'm going to increase it to 300. If you would like to increase it to 720, that is fine. So both the X resolution is 300 and Y resolution is 300 DPI or pixel per inch or dot per inch. So now press the OK button. So it is now converted to increase resolution image, but there is a bit of tricky part because you cannot just save it just like that. So if you save it or save as, then you cannot save as TIF, .tif. It will be saved, saved in such a way that that can be used only by this particular software called GIMP. So there is a trick here that you can bypass that. What you can do is you can export it. So let's uh, press on this export as. So it will take you exactly where it is um, at this moment. So you can change the name. So let us uh, change the name as figure four and keep the extension as it is, which is TIF. Now press export button. Now the next uh, option will be 
to see if you want to like it uh, compressed or not. The main reason is that when you increase the resolution, the size of the file increases. And most of the journals, they have got a limit, for example, 4 megabyte. Now, this particular file, it is not that big, so I, I don't want to compress it. I think its size is about 700 or 800 uh, kilobyte. So I think we'll be fine. But uh, if the file is quite big, then you, you would like to get it compressed so that the size of the file is reduced. Now press on export button and it is done. If you can see at the background, we have got this figure four and this figure four resolution will be higher. For example, if we press on the uh, right click and then we can go to properties in this properties section, if we press on details, it will show you what the current resolution is. And as you can see, the horizontal resolution is 300 dpi and the vertical resolution is 300 dpi. That is the minimal, minimum resolution required for publication of an article in the journals. Um, and as, as we have shown in figure three, the resolution was 96 uh, dpi. So in this way, you can uh, convert the low resolution images to high resolution images and that will be acceptable by most of the journals. Uh, thank you for watching and please don't forget to press on the subscribe button and also share with your colleagues and friends. If you have got any further questions or suggestions, please feel free to send me um, your comments. Thank you very much and see you later.